G'day guys, hope you're doing really well. Um, it's been a couple of weeks since I uploaded a video, which means it's been a f more than a couple of weeks since I recorded one. Um, cause from memory, that one was yeah quite well pre-recorded. So, um, yeah, it's a couple of days until Celebration Europe, which is pretty exciting. Even though I'm not going, I'm going to be hunched over my computer like a hermit. I'm not going to go outside. I'm not going to answer my phone. Um, <laughs> no, I won't be that extreme, but... Yeah, life has just been a bit crazy lately. Um, I've I got this week off, um, so I've got three more days until I start my new job. I quit my job last week because it was driving me bloody insane. Um, just long hours, hard work. Like, not, not that there's anything wrong with hard work, but you shouldn't be doing that kind of work for, you know, 14 hours a day. It's bloody stupid. Um, and just not getting paid a good enough rate to be working that hard so and the bosses treat you like shit but yeah you just treat it like a robot and it's just not worth it um it was just a really negative place and it was bringing me down and i had to find something else quick and i'm glad i'm glad i found something reasonably quick i was only there for like three months um when i started there it was it was okay like i thought it was gonna be all right and yeah it turns out it, it wasn't it just got worse and worse and worse and yeah, I don't know how guys have been there for, you know, five plus years because three months was enough for me. I feel like I've been there for 12 and the dogs have decided to start barking because I'm recording a video. Otherwise, they've been quiet all day. Um, yeah, so starting a new job, doing something completely different. Um, instead of traveling for an hour a day or half an hour to work, half an hour back, I'll be traveling for about three minutes, um, which is damn awesome. Um... But yeah, I'll be out and about. I won't be stuck in a factory like I have been the last few years. Um, been in and out of food industry factories for the last five or six years. So it'd be, it'd be good to have a change from that. Um, really good, actually. So I'll be sort of out on the road doing other things, which will be, which will be nice um, to get into, get into that. So And yeah, like I said, guys, it's been really flat out and... You know, the money I am earning isn't really going very far. The money I was earning isn't really going very far because it wasn't a lot. So, I'm looking forward to earning a bit more, bit more money, saving some money in different spots and being able to buy some more things. And, yeah, we're just really trying to save, save pretty hard to get over to America next year for celebration. Um, we've got our hearts set on that, so we're working pretty, pretty bloody hard to get over there. Um... But yeah, it's it's been tough, been a tough couple of months. So just found myself getting caught in a rut, and it'd be nice to get out of that. And um, yeah, you know, I was starting work at five o'clock in the morning, so driving to work in the dark, and I'll be finishing at like six or seven at night, so I'll be driving home in the dark, and it's just no way to live. So it just wasn't it wasn't very good. It didn't suit my lifestyle the way I wanted to. Um. But yeah, I haven't really bought a lot of bought, bought a lot of stuff lately. That's because there hasn't really been a lot out in terms of Star Wars stuff. All the shelves are sort of seem to be clearing out with sales, and looks like they want to put new stock out, but the new stock's just not coming. So, um, have been able to buy a few Lego sets, um, you know, over the last month or so. Like I bought Kylo Ren's shuttle, which you can just see there. Um, that was that's pretty awesome. I got that a while back. If you follow me on Instagram and Facebook, you kind of you kind of got a rough idea. I tend to keep that pretty up to date. It's easier to take a photo and post it up rather than record a five minute video and upload that. It's just a little bit more instant and a little bit easier to do. Um, but yeah, got a few more other things. Uh, yeah, not really been any new Star Wars figures. Hoping for some some more of the three and three quarter Force Awaken stuff to come out. That seems to have pretty much dried up. I mean, they've gone on clearance from 15 down to $7, and they're not really moving. Um, there's five or six figures I still need to get. Um, it's Black Series, I'm all caught up, except for, you know, the Shock Trooper, which I still need. Um, so we're sort of waiting for new stuff there as well. Um, new Wave shouldn't be too far away. We should have a couple of waves coming up pretty soon. But, um, yeah, like I was saying, Celebration Europe starts tomorrow. Um, it's Thursday the 14th here, so yeah, it starts tomorrow in London. Um, so that's pretty damn exciting. Um, 
But yeah, in terms of in terms of Star Wars stuff, it seems all the Force Awakens sort of stuff, like I said, products clearing out, so it's all died down a little bit. Um, and I think we're just in the middle of that dying down and Rogue One merchandise and, you know, the hype train all building up. And if we get a trailer at Europe this weekend, um, I dare say things will just start, start happening really quickly. Especially once Force Friday gets here in a couple of months. Um, you know, I'm sort of looking forward to that. I'm going to start putting some money away for that. Creating some more space in my room here so I can get ready for some more stuff. Um, I'm going to start moving on some bits and pieces of my collection. Um, mostly non-Star Wars stuff. I'll start moving on. I really need to focus and stuff like that. So, yeah. it's, it's Sorry, this isn't the most exciting video, guys. But, yeah, I just wanted to... A bit of a catch-up catch up video. Um... Trying, trying really hard to watch everyone's videos, but it's been hard. And ones I've been watching, I haven't always been commenting. But uh, yeah, I've been trying pretty hard. Playing Lego Star Wars. Um, I did grab that when it came out the week before last. Already finished the story. Um, and just going back through and just playing around again. That was a really good game. It's been one of my favourite Lego games for for a while. I have played a few of them. But it was really, really good fun. Lots of playability. Go back and play it all again. It's that was a good fun game. And I got the, I got the, bonus bits and pieces with it as well. Um, so that was cool. That was fun. So I might play a bit more of that tonight. But I kind of just want to sit back and watch something tonight. Um, it's been very, very tired lately. It's been a bit of a bummer, but. Anyway, guys, I won't sit and dribble for too much longer. Um, I'm going to try and get get some reviews in, and I want to review some Lego sets. Um, been on a big Lego kick lately, and not that there's been much I've sort of caught up with everything recently, but um, I've got some really cool sets. Um, looking forward to some new ones coming out. So, um, now I'll review some of the cooler ones I've picked up recently, and... Um, do some cool Lego videos, hopefully. Hopefully you guys like that. Um, but yeah, until until those next videos, guys, I hope you're all doing well once again. And we'll catch you very, very soon. Till then, may the force be with you.